My name is Brianna Venskis. I am an actress and you are here with The Desire Company. I would like to talk to you about something that not very many people get to do. And this may at first feel like a bit of a criticism or something negative. I promise you, it is not. I know you wanna know what that thing is. Getting notes, getting feedback, getting a redirection. If a casting director or a director or your agent give you a note or feedback on how to do that same thing you just did, but a little bit differently, that means you're golden. That means you're in. A lot of people could see this as a negative and could kind of get overwhelmed with the fact that, oh my God, I didn't do what they wanted. I, I did it wrong. They didn't like it. I got to do it again. I'm so str How do I redesign this entire thing that I've done? How, what do I do? Just breathe again. Inhale, exhale, get back to that baseline. This is the best case scenario for you to be in. If somebody has a note for you, that means that they saw something in you that they really, really liked. If you see someone have a glimmer of what you're looking for and that excites them, run with it. Do whatever they ask you to do. I cannot stress this enough. I can't tell you how many times I have either taken a note and not done it and lost a job or taken a note and tried to execute it and then got the job for my attempt at executing and or executing it correctly. So let me give you an example of what that might look like. You have a scene where you walk into a restaurant you walk in and you see the guy that you used to date. He was your ex-fiance. He's sitting down at the table with a new woman. You can have the initial audition of me walking in and going, oh my God. That sort of reaction, that sort of like, oh, oh my God, I can't believe I saw that guy sitting there. Or let's say the casting director watches that and goes, I like her look, I like her vibe. I think she has like, there's something in there. I don't quite know if it's there yet. I'm gonna give her this note. I'm gonna say, walk into the restaurant instead, see him sitting at the table, and instead of seeing him sitting at the table, make him notice you walk in the restaurant. Like, that's your note. I want him to see you and not you to see him. So my job now with that note, and this is the way I would interpret it, if I got the note to say, make him see you and not the other way around, I would say that I walk in, I see him, I know he's there, but I'm not gonna let him know he's there. Instead, I'm going to use that energy of me realizing he's sitting at the table. I'm gonna internalize it and I'm gonna draw his attention over to me. So instead of walking in and going, oh my God, he's sitting right there. It would instead be more of like a, a walk in and you'd see it. You'd maybe take a little beat and collect yourself and then walk the other way. And just have a bit of a moment where you can transform the same situation into a different ending. Do the best you can. Do something different than you originally did, but interpret that note the best you can and don't beat yourself up if you feel like you didn't knock it out of the park. They just wanted to see something a little bit different. Sometimes it's just for fun. It may feel sadistic on your end, but sometimes they just wanna see what else you can do. Give it your best, try your hardest, and for the love of God, if they say do something different, actually do something different.